My name is Jim Thomas and welcome to the Fitness Management Update. Our topic today is why does a gym fail? And of course, there can be many moving parts as to why a business might not succeed. You know, these are three that we want to talk about today that uh, we see of late, uh, we see a lot of, and, and perhaps could be relevant to potentially your situation or things you want to be mindful of moving forward. And number one is simply inexperience. Uh, you know, a, a, an owner might be a good trainer, but it doesn't mean they're good in sales or good in marketing. They're good with business planning. They're good with complaints. They're good with, uh, you know, a host of things that are the, the business aspect of it. And in terms of that inexperience, you know, things that, that you're not familiar with, make sure you surround yourself with people that are experts or surround yourself certainly with people that are better than you are at what you're asking them to do. Don't try to tackle all these things you don't have a background or experience in, or you don't have ready access to that information. Next, we see this a lot is personnel difficulties. You know, clubs are unable to recruit, unable to train, un unable to keep, you know, quality people. And, you know, part of this is having that system in place of how are you going to recruit, how are you going to hire, how are you going to train them, and then what's the process to make them successful. And this is, you know, easily could fall into the under that first uh, first bullet point of being inexperienced, you know, we don't know how to do this. You want to get yourself some professional help, you know, when you have these kind of issues. And then finally, too little money. You know, too many people go into business with the idea it's going to be perfect. And if everything's perfect, I've got enough money. And rarely, if ever, is it going to be perfect. And so being undercapitalized is going to be a big part of this. My name is Jim Thomas, and this has been the Fitness Management Update.